Hello everyone, Jamie here. So in this video I'm going to show you how to use your iPad as an additional screen to your computer. And this will work on both Mac and Windows PCs. Now to do this we need to go to the App Store on our iPad. So I'm just going to click on the App Store icon and we need to download a app called Splashtop Wired X Display HD. It's completely free and it's only about 11 megabytes in, in total. So it's a really small app and it is free so you know you can't complain uh, so we're just going to click on um, open and it's got some instructions so basically we just need to go to splashtop.com forward slash wired x display on your computer um, just to install the software so let's go to the PC so I've, I've gone to the, the website and as you can see here it says that you can download it for Mac or for for PC so for Windows so I'm on a Windows PC so I'm just going to click on download that one Okay, so it's downloaded. I'm just gonna open that up. Okay, and we're just gonna go through the setup process. I'm gonna click on next. I've already got it installed, but um, I'll just go through it again. I'm just gonna get that installed. Okay, and when the software installs, you're gonna get this screen. So you don't actually have to click on anything. You don't have to click on set resolution or anything like that. We can just go on to the next step, but you do have a few options here. There is one that says frame rate, and that's set to high, and quality is also set to high. So if you think it maybe is a little bit laggy, you can play about with those and uh, see if that makes it any better. Okay, and all we have to do now to get it working is we need to plug in the lightning cable into the computer, and we're gonna plug it into the iPad. So we're just gonna plug it in and it's gonna transfer over there. So as you can see, that was nice and quick and it's transferred over to the iPad. So I've got a second screen. So if I wanted to drag this over, I can do that. Can you see? And then if I move it back to the left, it comes back onto the computer. And it's just a really cool uh, extra feature really. So if you need an additional screen for whatever reason, you can now use your iPad as a second monitor. So if you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up. And if you hated it, subscribe. Okay, thanks very much, bye.